皆さんお疲れ様ですなるみです。実際のエリカとエリカの友達デバンテとでジェイコブと対談した動画は後から始まるんですがその前に皆さんにこの動画はボイスチューブさんにスポンサーしていただいています自分の興味に合わせて好きな動画で勉強することができるボイスチューブさんのすごい面白いなと思うところは YouTube の動画にサブタイトルがついているんですね日本語と英語そ,のそこでそのわからない単語が出てきたらそれをクリックするとその単語の意味がわかるんですよね前々から私はこう英語を勉強する上で一番大事なのはこうシャドーイングだったり言ってる人を真似するっていうことがすごく大事だって言って言い続けてきてるんですけどそれが簡単にできるサイトになってますコンテンツも選べて初級者向け中級者向あ上級者向けって3つに分かれていて、それもトイックとかトイフルで選ぶことができるので、自分に合ったこうレベルで動画を選んで、そこからあの自分が好きなエンターテインメントなのかっていうのを選べるので、自分が本当に興味があるなって思うところをこうターゲットとして選べるところがすごくおすすめかなと思います。台湾と香港を中心に42万人が月間使用しているこうグローバルにあの人気のあるサイトになっているのでぜひぜひこの英語学習が続かないなとか参考書を読んでてきついし覚えられないな英語生の英語覚えたいのにって思う人がいるからこういうボイスチューブから入って好きな動画を見て勉強してくれたらなと思います無料のコンテンツも使えるんですがこの無料に付け加えて有料のコンテンツもあってできる幅が少し変わってくるみたいなところもありますのでその内容は全部あの下のディスクリプションに入しておきますので興味のある方はぜひぜひあのダウンロードしてみてくださいで今回の動画はそのボイスチューブさんの中にあった面白い動画を一つピックアップしてきましたので私含め3人と議論していきたいと思います Without any further ado, let's get started! はい皆さんお疲れ様ですなるみです今日は We have special guest today Please go ahead and introduce yourself Devante. Devante and Devante is Erica's what?、Uh, high school classmate? <laughs> classmate? Classmate. Yeah, I guess. Friend. Friend, I guess. <laughs> So, Kyoa, I know. Sorry, I'm talking all Japanese, but don't worry. Yeah, does he like me? Seven surprising signs he, he does like. I cannot read. So, here it is seven signs that a guy likes you. Number one. People often say that if a guy's trying to impress you, that means he likes you. But that doesn't necessarily mean he likes you. It might mean he likes himself. See, narcissists give great first dates because they want you to fall in love with them and reflect their glory back at them. But the person who actually likes you shows that they are impressed by you. Is that true? Yeah, I mean, that's a pretty good point that he's making, honestly. Oh, yeah? Yeah.、Oh, what do you think it was? I think it's true. Like, you just want them to notice. Well, a little bit yes and a little bit no, because you, you want them to notice you and what you can do. Mm hmm. But that's because you want to be with them, you know? Right.、Um, so, when you two want the girl to know that you like them, do you, what do you do? Do you give them a compliment in a sense or no? I mean, yeah, compliments and maybe just a little teasing of like,、okay. and a little hint s of like, I like you. Uh huh, okay. Cool. What about you, man? Yeah, I mean,、uh, like you said, there's a little bit、mm -hmm. of both. I mean, certainly, like, if a guy likes a girl, he's gonna try to impress her、mm -hmm. to make her like him more.、Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, I think what he's saying too is like, if you're impressed by the girl that you like, then that shows more signs of like actual, genuine like, care for the person. Oh, cool. So. What about you, Erica?、Uh, Have you had the guy that impressed by you? What guy? I've had a guy try to impress me before.、Uh -huh. He climbed to the top of the playground、mm -hmm. and jumped off of it、mm -hmm. to try to impress me.、Mm -hmm. I had no interest in him, so I thought he was just being stupid. I just walked off with no interest. h a s t o get dressed up for an occasion when he's looking his best. He'll find an excuse on that day to send you a picture. He may not take a selfie and send it to you, but he'll take a picture of him with his brother or his mom and be like, hey, look, we're having a great day. What he's really saying is, look at me. This is the best dressed I've been all month, and I want you to see it. I, 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 
Like, I'd want them to see me like in person so I'd see their reaction myself. Yeah. Oh, okay. I, I maybe, but like I think this guy is just like speaking from personal. Like I don't think that this is something you can apply universally. Yeah, that okay. Like, that sounds kind of ridiculous. Sure. What about you? Have you ever received a picture from a guy? Uh, n- not like all dressed up. Like uh-huh. you know, like they don't dress up to take. Pictures, I guess. Okay. You know, I like, for, for girls' example, they do like send pictures, especially when they're like all Pretty. makeup on and whatever. Mm-hmm. But I don't think that really applies to guys. Okay. I think the guy version is, oh, look at my six pack. <laughs> <laughs> like someone stupid like that. You know, podcast to work to tell you about his day because you're the one he wants to share his news with. I'm not talking about the phone call he makes to you at midnight where he says, hey, I have some news. I have a boner. I disagree, kind of. I think a guy that wants to talk about how your day is, is the guy that likes you, not the guy that wants to talk about his day. Um, I think that's kind of BS. Okay, what about you? Totally Yeah! Yeah? There's two sides to that. Just because, like... If a guy's willing to like talk to you about like mm-hmm. how his day went and like be completely honest, he's mm-hmm. opening up to you, which is a good sign as well. Okay. Yeah, it should not. The whole phone call should not be about him, mm-hmm. but it is good that like it's an exchange and not just okay. all about yeah, like the a mutual. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Good point. Good point. Yeah. He's prepared to wait for intimacy. Doesn't mean he doesn't want it. Doesn't even mean he won't maybe try to have it early on. But when you delay him and you say that's not my speed, he still wants to see you again and he's more than prepared to wait. I agree with 100%. He'll wait for you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You'll wait. Oh. Definitely. Sure. Okay. Yeah. I mean, if you if you really like the person, yeah. Yeah. It's time to see you, even when it's not convenient. Now, I'm not saying he finds a day to see you or even three hours to see you, but when someone likes you, they will cobble together whatever time they have from the scraps just to be able to get 15 minutes to say hi to you. I'm not talking about the hookup right now. I'm talking about his desire just to see your face. When someone likes you, they make it happen. Yeah. Yeah? I would. You would. <laughs> yeah. I definitely have done that. You have done that? Yeah. And then somebody does that for you, right? No. <laughs> Erica? Aww. 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 <laughs> Next. Seven. Let this one sink in. He wants to go to the movies with you. After sex, most oh guys God. will take women on dates, go to I movies, go to dinners before they have sex, and then they wake up and they're like, Okay, now leave, please. I want to go and be with my friends. When you wake up with the guy and he's like, Hey, you with the crazy hair, let's go see a movie. He likes you. No, I'm not too adult you. I'm sorry. You guys in high school, I'm sorry. Her voice, but. Mm-hmm. I think that's just totally his opinion. I agree with yeah. completely agree with what you're saying. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, to, to make a claim such like that, mm-hmm. to say like, oh, you know, if you have sex after you see a movie, then he doesn't like you, mm-hmm. I think is what he's implying. Mm-hmm. And that's just not, this True. is ridiculous, you know what I mean? Like, okay. you can still like each other, it doesn't matter when it occurs, it's, it's not, it's not subject to that, I think. Correct? What about you, Eric? I think what he means, he just didn't quite deliver it correctly is like even if a guy has sex with you and still wants to hang out with you by the next day like mm. continuously still wants to hang out with mm. you then it shows that he really likes you mm. wants to keep spending time with you mm. it's just the way he words it's weird that's right and that was all that was seven signs so in our conclusion it just depends well i think i mean you can't. There was only five that I really disagreed with. Or, I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> that's, the, that's bad. I meant to say two. Okay. I think five that I agreed with. Okay. I think like you can't. Like yes, you can like broadly talk about it, but it really depends from person to person. Yeah. I think so too. You just can't take advice from people. You just have to really show it yourself. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so if you like somebody, to, for instance, what do you do? Like in your case. Oh, <laughs> I'm trying to. Get, oh, no. <laughs> I'm trying to get them to notice me for one, and then you know, 
take a little bit of their time mm -hmm. to talk to me mm -hmm. so we can you know, get to know each other better. Okay. That's common in high school now? I'd say so. Okay, cool. What about you, babe? Um, I guess for me, it's like, I, at my age, <laughs> like, I don't want to um, try to act like a different person to get somebody to like me. Mm -hmm. I think the age that I'm at, it's like, I'm old enough to where I have all these problems and situations in my life that if somebody can't handle that, then I, then it's not going to work out. Gotcha. You know? So it's like, I'm just going to be myself. And if they like me, then They'll like then it works out. Right. Otherwise, if not, then then move on. I shouldn't. Yeah, just move on. I shouldn't gotcha. even be. I shouldn't bother trying to get them to like me if they don't like who I am as a person. Gotcha. So, what about you? I agree. I agree with the thing he said at the end about being yourself. Mm. Because like, even though we're younger, or whatever, I don't think it's a good idea to put a fake front up, mm. knowing that that person's gonna eventually have to get to know you. Right. Thank you so much Hold for on. your time. One okay. more question. Go ahead. It's very typical the guy are meant to hunt, right? Mm. Biologically. People for... say if the guy likes you, mm. they'll text you or they'll call you. That's true. That's the biggest thing in a woman's world. So I wanted to call him, but I have to wait to find out if he likes me or not. But it's take a day, two days, three days. That means mm -hmm. clearly he's not interested in you. Am I true? <laughs> bullshit. Is it? Complete and utter bullshit. So if, if you, you like somebody, you should just do it. It doesn't care about your gender. True. But is it true? The guy, if the guy likes the girl, you will text her right away. I see what you're asking. Um, I mean, I still think it's BS. Like... <laughs> I don't feel like anybody should be making disparities between gender whenever it comes to love. I just feel like it's an utter nonsense. If if a guy is waiting to text a girl and waiting to call a girl, he might not know if she likes him. You know, the same applies, I feel like. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, Eric, how's your person? If you like somebody, you should call them, and it should be mutual. Mm -hmm. It shouldn't be determined by the, the man because he's a man. That's just... Oh, right. Yeah. Okay. What about you? I you said it better myself. <laughs> it's just like it could happen both ways. Like the guy can be like way more shy than the girl, and the girl can have like the most confidence there is, mm -hmm. so she can call you whatever she wants. Mm -hmm. You know, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay, you what know? about you, Eric? So going off of like him saying like if a guy's shy, if a guy's super shy and the girl is confident, but you know is going by that standard like oh the guy should call me first, and mm -hmm. the guy's too shy to, he's mm -hmm. gonna first off think that she's not interested because she won't text him, right? And then the girl's gonna think the same way because the guy won't do the same. Gotcha. So it's just a mutual like just awkward backfire. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then if you like it, go for it. Go for it. Just go for it. Yeah. Period. Go for it. Yeah. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, please follow them on in social media. Do you have social media? Yes, I do. Okay, great. So I'm gonna put it right here. But um, hit them up in the DM. <laughs> but they're all Japanese. <laughs> I'm sorry, but that's that. But we will see you all in our next video. Bye.